we thought we'd share with you today about how to feel reassured. And this is in complete response to the questions we've had coming in, because there are some major shifts going on on the planet. Earth is realigning with the higher vibrations. And as such, there are incredibly intense energies going on around the planet. And this is rather disconcerting for a lot of people. They are feeling it. They are feeling uh, oppressed by it. And it's and it's very, very confusing because it can be quite scary, especially when you realizing that it isn't. Why am I feeling like this? What's going on? Something major is happening. You know, you may not know exactly what is happening, but you know something is happening in a massive way around on the planet because you're sensing it, you're knowing it, you're seeing it, you're hearing it, and it's really, really bothering you. So we want to reassure you that all is good, all is well. It feels like we're on the cusp of a wave and it's really crushing up, ready to come over. And we're all thinking, oh, God, where are we going? <laughs> but we want to reassure you it's good. Good stuff is happening. <laughs> it feels bad. We have to go through the bad to get to the good. Absolutely. But yeah, please know you are never alone. We are with you. And lots of other people are. It's almost like we can link hands in our minds because we're all in this together. We're all little sparkles of light making a huge difference on this planet. Earth is ascending anyway, but it's whether we want to be dragged along by our feet, gripping mm -hmm. our fingernails into the planet, or whether we're choosing to go, we're choosing love, unconditional divine love. We are being that light for ourselves, and we are all doing this together. We're all in this together. So let's enjoy this wave and ride on it and surf. And can you find a humorous way of looking at this? This is an invitation for you because <laughs> everything gets really heavy, especially if you're watching the old media and going, oh, my goodness, what's happening? I, we are, both of us, we love to encourage people to look at the the final solution and we've given this wonderful analogy from um, someone that we work closely with who's a bit of a leader and they said it's as if we're all in a mixing bowl and we're all in there imagine the ingredients of a cake and it's all being stirred up and can you can you remember that feeling of we definitely sometimes feel like we're being stirred up the whole planet's being stirred up we're all in the mix and then what we're forgetting is that this will then go into an oven you won't be heated up but you'll go into an oven and soon this planet will be creating the most incredible delicious cake because from all that soggy mess is that we have got all those ingredients create a really nice cake and you can do your gluten free <laughs> and your vegan and all that it's fantastic it's your perfect cake but we are all of those ingredients now and we are definitely being stirred <laughs> up so go with it find your that. own analogy and if you've got a really, really humorous one or just something that's touched your heart, please share it with us. We love sharing these with everybody. So we'd love to hear from you. And <clears throat> can you feel a difference to your vibration when you're thinking about this in a lighthearted way? Like, oh, yes, yeah, some, someone's just turned on the pause button. <laughs> oh, no, off it goes again. <laughs> <laughs> I like that, Claire. So mine's a bit more serious. I think it's a bit like the birth canal, you know, <laughs> going through this process and it's a bit painful, <laughs> but we know there's going to be so much joy when it comes to fruition. And that's mm. what's going on right now. You know, cycles of life are all about this, aren't they? They're about growth, planting seeds and then watching it flower and manifest at the end. So please keep your focus on the outcome, on your outcome and how you want to be feeling the end of this and how you'd love to see everything and people around you they're feeling happier and free and having fun enjoying themselves and nurturing our beautiful planet and remember we are all safe 
all is well, all is good. And sometimes it seems like there's chaos, but out of chaos, like after the winter, like Helen's just described, everything starts to blossom in the spring. And when you think just from that bare soil, wow, look at what grows from it, what beauty and experiences grow from that. And that's what's happening on the planet. She is having a major planetary and humanity shift and we are all in the mix all right so let's plant some happy seeds yes <laughs> let's support and encourage each other if you are going to share everything fine we do understand there are leaders out there who need to have their megaphones to, to their role is to wake people up but if you're feeling burdened by it then choose what you are sharing with others that it's verbally through social media are you choosing fear or love okay food for thought again we love inspiring you and we really appreciate your wonderful questions so thank you so much for those yes thank you we will see you again soon we look forward to seeing you soon keep being that sparkly light <laughs> <laughs> bye bye